fractions are what you get when a whole object is divided into smaller parts. In this example, the whole is divided into two parts. Those parts are called halves. One half, two halves, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into three parts. Those parts are called thirds. One third, two thirds, three thirds, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into four parts. Those parts are called quarters. One quarter, two quarters, three quarters, four quarters, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into five parts. Those parts are called fifths. One fifth, two fifths, three fifths, four fifths, five fifths, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into six parts. Those parts are called sixths. One sixth, two sixths, three sixths, four sixths, five sixths, six sixths, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into seven parts. Those parts are called sevenths. One seventh, two sevenths, three sevenths, four sevenths, five sevenths, six sevenths, seven sevenths, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into eight parts. Those parts are called eighths. One eighth, two eighths, three eighths, four eighths, five eighths, six eighths, seven eighths, eight eighths, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into nine parts. Those parts are called ninths. One ninth, two ninths, three ninths, four ninths, five ninths, six ninths, seven ninths, eight ninths, nine ninths, which equal a whole. In this example, the whole is divided into ten parts. Those parts are called tenths. One tenth, two tenths, three tenths, four tenths, five tenths, six tenths, seven tenths, eight tenths, nine tenths, ten tenths, which equal a whole. 